Thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much, Annette. And uh, it's great to be here. We have, um, we have a great day ahead of us. Um, it's going to be super exciting. Um, but it's also taken a lot of greatness and excitement to get us where we are today. We really are in a digitalized world. Um, I think you all realize what it's taken to get us here, what level of innovation uh, has been required. Um, the way we live and the way we function today uh, is completely based on digitalized systems. Um, our power supply system, our fresh drinking water system, you know, we might think it's just water from the tap, but it does have a lot of digi di digitalization behind it for it to function today. Um, the way our government works, uh, the way our education system works, it's not just classes in a physical class loop, classroom anymore, is it? Um, maybe some of you have been to the doctor um, recently. Our medical records and the way hospitals are set up full of um, digitalized solutions. Um, today's broadcasting um, of this event would not be possible without um, digi solutions. So look, it's taken innovation uh, to get us where we are. Um, but since we rely so much on um, digitalized solutions, that's also where we're vulnerable. And this is the bad news. Anyone or anything who would like um, to do something to us which isn't full of good intentions, anyone with, you know, a bit of malicious intention, where would they, where would they try to hit? Well, they would hit things that we depend on, right? And a lot of that would be um, the digitalized solutions. Um, If, um, if we think about it this way, we see a lot of disinformation today. Look at Russia's illegal and unprovoked aggression against Ukraine. Uh, we see a conflict full of misinformation and disinformation. What does that do to our societies? That actually hurts our democracies. We want to have peaceful, inclusive democracies, but misinformation and disinformation is contributing to polarize our societies. We also see hacking, we see attacks to many of the daily systems that we de depend on. Now to the good news. We are all here because we're going to try to do something about this. We need to work together to prevent these things from happening. But we also need to up our game. Because many of these hackers or, or those with malicious intent, they're one step ahead. They're super smart and they're skilled. And we are struggling to keep up uh, with that speed. Um, but doing something um, is the best thing we can do. Uh, and that's why we're here. We are... Uh, here today to work with, in particular, young people and with educators. We really believe from the Nordic Council of Ministers that we need to work with people at an early stage. Starting with young people is, is, is a really good option. Uh, working with educators for the multiplying effect is also really important. We would like to see our region be the most integrated region by the year 2030. That's our vision. But if we are going to do that, and if we're going to succeed, we need to get smarter, and we need to get more skilled, and we need to build knowledge. As you all know, uh, digitalization, data, all these things, they don't respect borders. These things are crossing borders all the time. That's why we need to work together. It doesn't help if just one country does it, or one town, or one school. We need all of us uh, to be included. Um, otherwise, we will not really get anywhere. 
So we're here today. Um, we're going to do our part to try and up our game. Um, we're going to work really hard um, and we're going to get smarter. We're going to get more knowledgeable. We're going to get more skilled so that we can keep up and not just respond to when things happen, but actually prevent things from happening. Um, I'm very excited to be here, uh, and I'm particularly excited personally to see how the young people will be working and uh, in the battles and the games that we have set up for them. Um, I hope many of you would agree with me that um, we can learn a lot uh, from those who are younger than us. Uh, many of these things come so naturally to them, uh, than perhaps to, to some of the older generations. Thank you so much, uh, everyone, for, for coming here. Thank you so much, CTF Tech, for working with us. And of course, uh, my own great team, um, our office here in Tartu, and uh, my colleague Grete, and uh, everyone around me uh, in my own um, organization, including our colleagues also traveling from, from Copenhagen. So super excited to be here and uh, have a great day, everyone.